will get you to what mm -hmm. consciousness is. Right. Well, he says that very much, I believe. Mm -hmm. yeah, he says, um, I will, what do I do with that? continuous process of differentiation to infinity, absolutely nothing. I will not be able to build. I will not be able to operate. So it's not enough for me yeah, to, to think or to say that the thinking process is a system that projects to infinity operations that are exclusively different Differentiation. differentiation yes yeah. but rather that there is another way to operate with the mind than the only the differences that are placed in an act and allows that mind another system another functioning to the differences place and allows the system to relate between them but what is it that we relate and how is the system of relation the system of relation also works with differences because you cannot establish a relationship between two things that have not been differentiated first mm -hmm. wow. in such a way that i cannot relate different things different little wheels among them and and say all of those are part of this recorder. I cannot establish these relations between the little pieces if I do not make a difference between each one of them. So it is valid that to say that the thinking process work through differences, that the thinking process relate those differences or make connections between this, this difference. Relate what? The differences. And you cannot relate but differences. So once you establish the differences, you can relate them. Then that, that's... So we go again and say it is valid to say that the work of differentiating is proper. Mm -hmm. But what do you do with the differences? Is to relate among them. So you can establish the structure. Yeah, or whatever. He, maybe he's, he didn't say that, but no. you can understand how they are related among them. So you can't see relations unless you have differentiation. Exactly right. That's kind of what I get. Yeah. So even though when you establish relations, I also rela establish relations between differences. You will say, but sometimes I can relate things that are the same or similar because they're so similar and then I am not doing differences. Nope. The contrary. I am making differences and and I am saying that this is different than the other even though they are similar and they relate among them because they're similar. Fuck. What a subtle thing, yeah? yeah? And what do you think that I am that that I am doing? I am relating differences and this is going we are going to see it a little bit uh, uh, later on this okay when I end up saying quotes the structure of the recorder is such and such yeah and it's not possible that you charge me three hundred dollars, yeah. <laughs> but when the I, I have no idea how to translate that. It says it's, the structure is again recorded is such and such, and you cannot can you cannot charge me three hundred dollars for this part. And when can you tell me how much this costs and this and that and that by putting it all together cannot be more than one hundred dollars you cannot charge me all of that let's let's talk then let's talk about a different recorder in such a way that I have I am establishing differences in between the different elements that make the object 
an object. I, re I am related the elements among them and what I am relating, just differences. And then later I make a synthesis. So then I go and I have an image, more or less an image, yeah, of what could be this recorder according to the degree of information that I have and then I, I am establishing relationship each time more compact and I compact the differences and then I am synthesizing. But what I have used to be the conductor thread or the the common thread? Common thread. Right. Yes. Sorry about the thing of the $300. That's totally not clear to me, not even in Spanish. So I'm going to leave it uh, leave it there and we can go back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My guiding thread is always the difference. To fix an interest or fix an ambit is before anything to make a difference. Yeah. The differences within the object, the little parts, the different parts of the entire thing, they have a relationship of ambit. They are in, con they are in the same ambit. They can be related only within that ambit. It is not legitimate of a coherent thinking, a thinking in which you establish a relation between objects that are outside in different ambit. Because how I am going to say, for example, in this particular recorder, I fix the difference. This recorder with other objects and in this recorder there is one two three five six parts and seven and then I go to another recorder yeah. that could not be possible right how I, I, I am going to relate differences that exist in different ambits you cannot do that with the coherent thinking you can only relate differences within a predetermined ambit. So all the relationship that we can establish among this object will be differences that I found in the object. Mm -hmm. I cannot go outside. Mm -hmm. So when you fix an interest or you fix an ambit is before anything is to learn to differentiate. The differences have a have a relationship that is within the ambit in which they are they exist and they relate because this ambit is fixed and they do not relate with entities of other ambits being the relationship also affected by differences perfectly well if we say for example according to this that the relationship a equals a do not proceed by difference, for example, that the idea of identity, that the one thing is equal or identical to itself, and how I am going to be the same, and he, that person is him, and the other person is somebody else, and that way, and you know, continuing. Uh, if we say that the relation A is identical to A, you do not proceed by difference. We have to say at least this first. There is an ambit of relation fixed by equality. Ooh, this is heavy, huh? So we have A, yeah? And then we have a symbol equal. Yeah? And then we have A again. Yeah? <laughs> so <laughs> that's fine. First, there is an ambit of relation given by the equality, so the equal symbol, right? And the first thing that we say is that we are using a equal sign in order to say that, yeah, and that these are identical, we are using the relationship equal, very good. And what is that relationship that we are establishing when we say A is equal A? When we do this, we are saying that the relationship is not an addition. We are differentiating. Yeah? It's not a P 
plus a. No, that will be a subtraction, right? So it's a completely different type of relation. It's a relation that we differentiate we, and we establish a precise relationship that is of equality. And what do we say? First question, then given the entire system of relation that we know, we differentiate the one that we are interested, that is the one of equality, right? Mm -hmm. This is to begin with. So from the very beginning, we put a system of a system of relation and we differentiate from all the other system of relationship that we know. <laughs> so <laughs> well, then we, you can say things like A plus A, for example. You can say whatever you want and you can say many more things. Nevertheless, you're looking for the relationship of equal. And then when you place it, you make a difference. Mm -hmm. yeah? So A equal A it's not a it's plus not, a or a minus it's a. It's not a, yeah, and that's how we know that a is, is equal a. Uh, Let's stop. Yes. Because <laughs> that's a pretty clear place to stop. Yeah, it is. We can stop. <laughs> yeah. I love this stuff because it's this really is what I teach in <laughs> Excel. In, right. Database logic. You know. It's relational yes. operators. Right, relational operators. Greater than, less than, equal to, not mm -hmm. equal to. Um, and you can only know because they're not equal. Yeah. <laughs> we can stop. Uh -huh. Relational operators. Yeah. And you can use often Venn diagrams are an easy way, you know, intersecting circles. But boy. To the, show the, that also. For me, it's a, quite a. a a refreshing thing. He's to, going through a tour de force of yes. how to think. Exactly uh -huh. right. And it's not, I mean, for the and discipline. It is, it, it, um, it is, and it almost feels like he got even underneath the method. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's going back to it's giving us the, the, the first the, principle. The, right, so. the, the kind of the building blocks. Yeah, the building the, blocks. The building blocks yeah. of Foundation. the entire, of the entire thing yeah. of the method is here. When did here. he do this talk? In Corfu. In June 1975. You weren't there. He was there. Kurt was there. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody to him. And, and that's why he hasn't unscrambled right. yet. Still and trying to unscramble. He was in the second group and then in September he did kind of a, a different presentation of the same thing and they put it all together in one material. Yeah, which was what the introduction said. September plus June equals what we have before us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's very. Do you no, want to take a break or? Yeah, no, I'm just since that this is kind of a synthesis. Right yes, now. it is. It is. That's synthesis. good. What you said, Ken, about the how you related it to what you're doing, teaching with the computer. Mm -hmm. Yes. This particular and part. Uh, there's another way to look at mm. uh, something equals something in computer programs. They sometimes use the double equals. The double equal, right? Yeah. Whereas, because equal, equal. it, it's one thing to say that A equals A, right? Mm -hmm. Both sides are exactly equal. You can also say A is equivalent to B. They usually use the double equals for that, right. I think. So, the equivalences. You say so what this side is equal. It's not exactly the, the the two things are not the same, but whatever is on this side is equivalent to whatever is on that side. Uh -huh. You could say um, Kurt, greater than like Kurt. If it was Kurt, so for Kurt to equal Kurt, you've got to be there. But you could say male Ken as a male is equivalent to Kurt as a male. You know what I mean? It's uh -huh. slightly different. One is exactly equal, but the other is. Uh, so all the relations that relational we can establish are essentially because we can ex <coughs> we can separate them, make a difference. Mm -hmm. Yes, that is. I've never thought about it like that. No, before. me neither. Me neither. Yeah. Uh, until I read this. Yeah. So you have to start. I mean, it's one of those things that 
you accept that that's how it is, but you right. never went a little further and it, said, right. why is it like why that? Why it is that way? Because mm -hmm. I would, wise, we will not be able to fix anything. No. And, and it's really interesting. So, so the thinking process gets determined when we fix an interest. Mm -hmm. Loses the freedom, but th that yes. loss of freedom allows us to understand. Yeah. You know? And it's really beautiful. Mm -hmm. Because if there, there is a consciousness, you know, structuring all the stuff yeah, all the time, you know, what, but um, s sets us apart. Really, yeah, as, as right that we can do that. That we can do we have that. the ability to do that. Very pretty. <coughs>